All right, what's up, guys? We're back here with another album review, and today we're looking at Metallica's 2016 album, Hardwired to Self Destruct. This is one of their best works. I think it's okay. This is my ranking list. Number one would, for me, would be the Black album. Number two would be this album, and number three would be Injustice for All. You guys are probably flipping your shit because I just said that, but you know what? That's my opinion. This album is great. Um, yeah, hardwired to self-destruct. Um, The first song that I want to mention on this album is the uh, title track. The title track is just thrash as fuck, and it's great. Metallica has truly gone back to their old ways. Now, I know they had to change up the drum beats and the guitars and all the vocals and stuff because they're getting uh, James Hetfield is becoming a grandpa. Um, metaphorically, he doesn't. I don't. I don't think he has kids. But he's becoming an old grandpa. Um, so they had to change up because they're not as... They're not what they used to be. <laughs> they're becoming old men. I know a lot of people don't want to hear me say that, but you know what? Metallica's getting old. Um, I mean, Jesus, they've been around for almost 40 years now. Um, yeah. Yeah. But I really want to talk about uh, the uh, Murder One song. Unfortunately, a year prior to this album, uh, Rip Lemmy, Lemmy of Motor of Motorhead, or in Brutal Legend, also known as the Killmaster, um, uh, unfortunately passed away and produced his last album, Bad Magic, which was actually one of his best, in my opinion. Um, but they made a tribute song to him called Murder One. And the uh, music video for it included uh, animated uh, Killmaster. I'm just going to call him the Killmaster that, now because Rip Lemmy and that name is so badass. Anyway, the Killmaster, yeah. Also, I really like Brutal Legend. But, um, yeah, this album as a whole is. Ah, <sighs> oh, shit. I really. I really, really enjoyed this album. Um, Murder One is such a good song. And it's a tribute to the Killmaster, of course. And then, of course, you got Atlas Rise, which was another great song. And then, of course, you got... Um... Ah, shit. You got uh... oh, one of my favorite songs in this album, Spit Out the Boner. Uh, I mean, Bone. I didn't say boner. Um, spit out the bone. Um, anyway, yeah, another great song. Badass drum riff, too. I, did I just say drum riff? Oh, God, it's still pretty early. Um, drum beat. Nice, nice beat. You can beat your meat to it. Um, then you also got uh, my favorite song in the album, Here Comes Revenge. Oh, uh, that, that song. Then you also got. I'm trying to repeat. Uh, spit out the bone. Um, then you also got. Um, hmm. Oh, the one song I don't like on this album, Moth and the Flame, because they did a song with Lady Gaga. I fucking hate Lady Gaga. She can go fuck herself. I, fuck Lady Gaga. 
she's in, she's the reason talented is she is the reason music is so untalented today because she makes shitty pop music. She is the epitome of a shitty pop band. Although I will say um, recently, because again, I'm the kind of guy that gives everything a chance. Um, I recently discovered a pop artist that is actually pretty talented and I somewhat enjoy the music. Uh, I know she's pretty popular. Um, I know my little brother likes her, but uh, Billie Eilish, um, I actually started getting into some of her stuff and she's actually pretty talented. I mean, she's what, I think she's like 17 or something like that, but I was actually somewhat surprised that it wasn't another shitty pop man. I was somewhat surprised with the music itself. So, yeah, with that said, um, I may or may not review a couple of her albums in the future. I don't know. I mean, I've always liked some pop. Like, I saw, I, I, uh, in January this year, I went to see a uh, painting at the disco and then I, I like fallout boy. Um, and then you also got, um, another one that I recently got into was, uh, no, not that one, but another band that I really like that's somewhat pop would be the killers. Highly enjoy the killers. The killers is actually one of my favorite bands. Um, they got, their music is just simply amazing. Um, yeah, I got nothing else to say about this one, so remember to leave a comment, like, and subscribe.